finance news you need to know today. The Federal Reserve is raising a key interest rate for the first time in a year, reflecting a resilient U.S. economy and expectations of higher inflation. The Fed has increased its benchmark interest rate by a quarter of 1% to a range of 0.5 to 0.75%, its first move in a year. The Fed also signaled three likely hikes in 2017, up from two previously. In response the Australian dollar has dropped sharply against the US dollar. At 0630 at on Thursday, the local unit was trading at 74.53 US cents, down from 74.89 cents on Wednesday. The Australian share market is set to open lower, following Wall Street down after the US Federal Reserve interest rate hike. At 0646 at on Thursday, the local SPY 200 share price futures index was down 10 points, or 0.18%, at 55.72 points. Elsewhere New York, oil major ExxonMobil says President Darren Woods will become chief executive in January after the retirement of Rex Tillerson, who is U.S. President-elect Donald Trump's pick for Secretary of State. Los Angeles Amazon has officially fired the starting gun on its worldwide race against Netflix to capture subscription video viewers, and its global prime video service is priced well under Netflix. Washington, D.C., U.S. President-elect Donald Trump and Silicon Valley executives will have a chance to smooth over frictions when they meet at his Manhattan Tower after both sides made no secret of their disdain for each other during the presidential campaign. Washington, D.C., Federal Reserve Chair Janet Yellen said that the economy doesn't need fiscal stimulus from the incoming Trump administration. Dr. Yellen said on Wednesday at a news conference after the Fed's move to hike benchmark interest rates that such policies would be unlikely to maximize employment, since the unemployment rate is now at 4.6 percent, slightly below the Fed's own long-term target.